The Chargers have played games in Cleveland in December in the past. It's normally bitter cold and played in blizzards. They get a break Saturday afternoon. Weather 42 degrees and light rain. We'll face a Cleveland Browns team that's 0-14, possibly headed to the second worst all-time record in the NFL. The Browns have had enormous problems at quarterback. They've started five different ones this season. Robert Griffin III, former high number one draft pick of the Washington Redskins, is back on the field as the Browns' starting quarterback. He had a tremendous rookie season in 2012. Since then, he's 4-14 because of injuries. Coach Mike McCoy is amazed at what happened to the former Baylor star, but admits young QBs go through tough learning curves. For a young quarterback, it, it's a tough business. It, it could be very humbling coming from the way some of these players are playing in college and the yards they're throwing for and, you know, a very large number of touchdown passes, very few interceptions, and all of a sudden you come to this game and, wow, you know, you, you get blown away a little bit. So it, it's, it takes some time. You know, the more – and there's nothing like experience. You know, you're going to have some growing pains as a young quarterback in the NFL. How bad is Cleveland? The Browns are 30th in the NFL in offense, 31st in the NFL in defense, giving up 400 yards per game. Off the field, the University of San Diego has a new director of athletics who starts on the job this coming week. Bill McGillis, who built the South Florida program into a Division I status and then rebuilt Southern Mississippi, has the unique opportunity to come home to the West Coast and take over the University of San Diego program. He says he's got unique priorities for the Terreros. Look at the trophies. There's no ceiling at USD. There's no ceiling here. And a lot of evidence of that, maybe none more so than this football team becoming the first non-scholarship football program to win a playoff game in FCS history. Covering the Chargers, the Terreros, and the Aztecs. Have yourself a great sports weekend. Lee Hamilton, CW6 Sports.